with me straight away. Get him, Jared. Get him, Jared. <laughs> Collision, wasn't it? Oh, did you have a collision, Judith? Oh, Phoebe, come on, Nala. Phoebe, good girl, Judith. Run, Judith, run. off her neck. Come on, quick! Run, Jude! They're gonna get you, Jude! They're gonna get you! They're gonna get you. Phoebe! The reason I'm stopping her a bit now is because she's getting older and they tolerate puppies doing that really well but at some point they're not so it's just preventing potential future issues but, um, I started listening I've listened to it all I will admit on a podcast um, and it was about group living with dogs it was like a multiple dog household and preventing issues and stuff um and they said that like having a load of females together uh is hard because even though the females generally have less issues less spats with one another when they do they never forget it so it's a lot of management which yeah, it makes sense, but I think it's the blend of temperaments you have and, yeah, preventing issues. And I see a lot of issues, I see a lot of people have issues, whether it's a one dog or a multi-dog household, with resource garden. Like, my dog's really protective over this toy, this chew, this bone. Why does, it doesn't need a toy and it doesn't need a chew to survive. Take them off it. If your dog can't handle having a toy and you being near the toy or a chew, just take it off him. Doesn't matter. Um, it's just, it's such a simple solution. I think people forget. Like I, do, I leave toys of mine unsupervised all the time, but I wouldn't leave like a long lasting bone or two unsupervised because you can bet that they'll all want the same one and the one will want to look after no no this is Poddy's one Pod um, they'll all want the same one and they'll argue fight over the one they wanted even though there might be several they have, like, chews and stuff if I'm around, but not if I'm not. Um, it, it's just common sense, in my opinion, you know. And if you want them to have a chew while you're in the house, put them in a crate. They can't resource guard when they're in a crate and you're outside of the crate. Just... Life easy. I don't know what that is. <laughs> you see the greener cat. There's loads of good ones up there. But I don't really want to give you a, another video where we're picking blackberries, even though the dogs love it. We can pick blackberries in our own time, can't we, Judith? Did you have fun in your training session yesterday, Jude? So I put up a couple of pictures 
on our Facebook and Instagram. I remember to do Instagram as well. Um, but the full video, I haven't set it live yet, but it'll be live by the time this video goes out, is on the member section of the YouTube channel. So it was unedited, warts and all, first training session with Pod and Jude together, working together. So I had some things where they were doing the same thing at the same time. And then I had others where Pod was targeting um, a stool and then Jude was going under him. I had Pod lying down, Jude going over him. Pod sitting and Jude circling him. Um, so yeah, it was for the first attempt, it was successful. Um, I tried to get them to spin and twist together, but they were doing it at different times and one was half doing one and I, so we got practice to do but yeah that's on the members section of our channel and I know I don't say it enough but I am super grateful for every one of you that watches all of these videos to all of our members of team Harvena that are on the members section and yeah it's cool and I need to sort out more um emojis i managed to get two one of aria one of jude but i can't quite figure out how they're accepting them because there's a lot of ones i've tried of photos and they've rejected them so I need to figure out why they accepted the two they did and rejected the others but anyway i am going to work on at least an emoji each i think i've got to have the members section for a certain amount of time before I could have as many as eight. I think I can have up to five right now. Oh yeah, there's good ones there. Look. They're like, but mum, when you pick them, it's easier for us. Jude, there's good ones there. Phoebs, there's good ones there. Sit. Bag. Good girl. Um, so yeah, not much more to update you on really. Um nothing. I don't think. I'm gonna leave this here and wait for them to do something a bit more exciting than eat blackberries. Good girl, banana. Did she kill you? Did she kill you, banana? Run, banana. Oh, pumpkin, you pretty girl. Pumps. Handsome boy, potty. Pretty boy, Podward. Got boy. Body, body. You've been through cobwebs. Look at you. Look at you. Look at you. Oh, got boy. <laughs> He's properly in on me, so. Come on in. Right, you gotta get on with our day, haven't we? Oh, I got up like early because my wrist is hurting. And then I couldn't go back to sleep. And then I'm, yeah. I'm tired and it's only morning, you know. Never mind. Tell Vivi still pretty tired after yesterday. Not gonna do a massive one. Oh, I didn't plan to do a big one anyway. But just wander down here and wander back on ourselves and go home. <sighs> Passes have arrived for the show as well on Monday.
following her nose a lot now. Yeah. gonna leave this video here and I shall see you all soon. Bye!